right y'all so today we have this wig from ali pearl hair they sent me this unit um i'm just doing an unboxing so here's the wig clearly we're gonna set that to the side this wig came with a satin scarf and an elastic band it also came with another satin scarf but i think this is more of like a headband it came with an edge brush some lashes and a satin bag to hold the wig in Here's the wig. This is an HD lace. It's a 5x5 closure and it's 22 inches. As you can see, it's 150 density or 180 density actually. And yes, this is how it came. Pre-plucked and the hair is clearly very, very thick. So I'm going to be showing you guys how I plucked my hair. So I start off just hot combing the front of the hair down. So I can see how it's going to lay, especially since this is straight hair, it's like, it's showing you exactly how it's going to look on your head when you do this. So yeah, that's the first step of how I pluck my hair. After this, I'm just going to section off the pieces that are already um, pre-plucked. You don't want to over pluck the front. So I would just section that part out a little bit. And this is what I'm doing here. After sectioning it off, I just hot comb the hair to the front just to keep it out the way. There's no specific real reason why I do this. Just I like my workspace to be like neat. It just makes it easier. So here you see me plucking. I'm plucking, plucking, plucking. I pluck behind where I actually want the hair to be missing from, if you know what I mean. So I sped it up a little bit here. But you can see where I'm starting to pluck from. Um, I don't ever pluck too much because, you know, I'm going to keep sectioning off and plucking behind. If you get what I mean. Like, you can see what I'm doing. I'm sectioning off where I'm plucking already and then plucking more. I like to do it little by little because you don't want to over pluck and, you know, have a balding frontal or closure. Um, you're going to see me continuously like hot comb it and then um, plug and hot comb. But this is a good angle for where you see how I'm plucking it. So like with this method, you don't have to be shy with the tweezers. You don't have to know exactly like where you're plucking. I really just pluck randomly and until it gets, you know, thin. Like the bottom section right now is like good enough like you could leave it like that but i would say don't be shy don't over pluck and make it bald but like don't be scared to pluck a good amount just because you section off the front and no matter what it looks like behind there it'll still look good because the front is pre-plucked and not over plucked so here i'm just repeating the same process over and over checking to make sure it's not over plucked and then going back in and plucking more Here you see me plucking the front a little bit. So this is where it gets tedious, kind of. I just put the hair back um, where it belongs, and I pluck out the spots that have, like, you know, black knots still, or I just don't want it to look, like, straight across. And I only do a little bit there. Don't, don't overpluck there. That's not where you could just go crazy with the plucking, like, you know, just make it look a little more natural around the hairline. At this point, I'm sectioning off my hair. This is how I prep my wigs to go on my head. So I section off little by little, you know, to the part that you want. And I'm doing a middle part for this one. So you see me just sectioning and then hot combing, adding some wax in some places. I just like a super flat wig. So this is how I ensure it'll be flat. Even on my head, I hot comb it even more to make it flat, but this helps. You know, you could do this on your head, too, instead of doing it um, while you're plucking. Oh, by the way, the wig is on my knee with a towel under it. I don't know why I didn't mention that before, but this helps you see exactly what you're doing, like the light-colored um, 
towel so yeah this is how I pluck this is what it looks like and I'm just gonna get into installing this wig I have detailed wig install videos already on my channel actually I'm gonna tag one in the corner of this video on the cards so if you want to see that just click on one of those but I'll see y'all at the end of the video
right y'all so this is the end of the video this hair is from ali pearl hair well just ali pearl they sent me this 22 inch 5x5 closure just comes down farther than my waist actually it's super long and full as you can see all right i really love this hair this is a hd lace and clearly it's melted so definitely recommend this wig it's giving it's really giving I think my next video I'm gonna try to do a flexi rod set on this hair because it's gonna turn out like I think it's gonna turn out good for the first time I'm gonna use flexi rods so stay tuned for that but yeah I'm gonna have all the details in the description box below so if you want to get this hair check out this hair um, I will see y'all in my next video thank you for watching peace